Hello everyone, today I will show you what's the status bar in Scratch. So this is my Scratch here. So the blue bar here is the status bar. So if you click on the Scratch logo, it will tell you, it will open a window saying about Scratch. It will tell you what version it is and what's the Chrome, etc. Next is the language radio. Here it will you can change any to any languages. It has a large variety of languages that you could choose. So here I have chosen Spanish and I'll change it to English because I can't understand Spanish. So next is file we know they save and load and new. New basically mm, adds a new what you call mm, new for file. It places the old one and puts a new. It will ask you if you have something. It will ask you to it will if you, um, it will replace the file. Next it is the edit. In edit there is the turn on turbo mode and restore. I can't uh, use restore right now, but I will do it later. So I've turned on turbo mode. So it basically. Mm, it basically makes your computer run uh, the scratch program as fast as it can. It does not affect any waiting blocks, the wait block, but it will make it that the computer runs um, as fast as it can. Uh, now you cannot see it because um, it is a more small, what you call, small script. But if it is a very big script, then you will able to see the difference. So let me just turn it off and you can see it's my restore is not working some for some reason but i will turn see that for some later time so i turned it off next is the um, uh, what you call tutorials there are loads of lots of tutorials in scratch animations artwork music games stories etc other things too next is the uh, scratch project name here you will put the project name so it's not currently working for me here but let me just reopen scratch for a minute ah it is open now let me just test it again yeah it's typing test one see i have written here test one so um, yeah that's all about this thank you and keep watching